Welcome to a local edition. I'm Bella Shaw. We're joined by Lisa Carey, who always carries some interesting messages about various festivals. She goes from one festival to another all year long. The Harvest Festival is upon us. It's, it's lovely. It's the original art and craft show and you know it's been around for 43 years. It's a great tradition and it's the largest and most prestigious indoor arts and craft show on the West Coast. Because not everyone can just get a booth and display their arts and crafts. Right, right. They have to be judged first. So what does that mean? Well, it's a juried showcase. And what that does is it allows the patrons to know that when they come there, everything is made in the USA. It's handcrafted. It guarantees that quality. And that's the tradition that they stand by. So when you say, I want to be an exhibitor, you have to go through a lengthy process. I mean, you even have to show them pictures and, and videos of you working in your workspace, creating. You don't just give a photo of your art piece. You have to show them your workshop and they have to have that confidence that you're not just taking some accessory and you know, adding a little accoutrement to make it your own. It's handcrafted and it's a work of art and it's a passion. So mm -hmm. what's nice is these artists all get together from throughout the United States and it's um, they feel really great being able to show their works and share it and you can visit with them and they also get into it a little bit with costumes and they enjoy sharing their passion and it's really what makes it fun. Well, I think you have a couple of examples of the quality of the work. Yes. That this looks like exactly I mean, it, like a coach bag. It's this, so lovely. This, this is Connie, detail. Connie Gunderson. She's actually local in Ventura and um, she has a, her showcase is called Heavenly Accents and you can kind of see it because she takes just the extra time to add that personal touch and she thinks of everything. You've got a little panel for your phone, mm, you know, and, up and, and it's light and it's just... Lined, completely lined. It's so, just efficient and I know very it sounds crazy because artistic. it's October, but really you could do your holiday shopping at this uh, Harvest Festival, couldn't you? I laugh um, because I come out there with bags because <laughs> what's wonderful is you can see something that you love and you know your friends or whoever is going to love it too and then you can just keep it stored and then you whip it out and it's something that you're not going to find at a mall. No, no. It's handcrafted and people will go, where'd you get it? And then they can't go get it unless yeah. they come the following year or something and they, you know, find something different. But um, that's what makes it unique too, is that you're not gonna be able to shop anywhere else. Um, and so, it, and they make it a really fun, entertaining shopping experience. They've got strolling performers and onstage performances. Lots of food specialty foods and they have a kid zone so kids can let loose and they have um, Lowe's is going to be out there doing some potting take home some free mementos there's a pumpkin patch so you just bring the family yeah, yeah. kind of thought of everything yeah how about a leopard print oh you <laughs> saw that I have been hiding that this one is one of my favorites because this handle and how it opens and you can see the stitching it's just it's really it's amazing. Very and you well can see done. labor of love, you know? Yeah, it really And is. then she's got a little thing for your keys you can stick on there. And it just buttons up really tight. Very and elegant. Just lovely. So fashionable. Yeah, it really is. Now, um, Every, this benefits, right? Uh, the nonprofits. Right. You can bring a can of food. You can participate. Yes. Thank you for asking that because um, when they come to Ventura, they really want to make a difference um, for the community. And last year, we raised over 4,000 pounds of food when people brought uh, canned goods and they donated them to Food Share. And we also have Clinica's Del Camino Real is coming out and they're going to have their mobile truck. You can get a and health they can screening. just check the website to find yeah. out what else is going on. Right. Lisa Carey, thank you so much for joining us here on Local Edition. I'm Bella Shaw. See you next time.